So we're looking at the visitor history page and this will let you review the clicks that have come through the system on a sub ID level and you can choose to display quite a few more clicks on this page than um, on other pages like the spy view and you can show all clicks real clicks filtered out clicks or converted clicks so let's quickly do converted and you'll see that it only shows the converted sub IDs or we can show real clicks and these are clicks that have not been filtered out yet you see those here and clicks are filtered out if um, an IP hits your page um, more than once uh, in a 24 hour basis and so the second click will get filtered out. Um, this is a good uh, view to use especially if you've got um, like ad bots that hit your page to review your ads. You'll notice that they'll hit the page multiple times and you want to get a better look at the actual traffic hitting your company so you filter and show only the real clicks. Let's go back to all clicks right now. Um, so you see the sub ID, the time of the click, the country flag, the traffic source, and this shows a dollar sign if it was converted. Um, this means that the click is brand new, and this red means that the click has been filtered out. And then the IP address, landing page, uh, refer, text ad, and keyword information. And so, um, I've got this script automatically randomly creating um, um, IP addresses so that you can get an ex example of what it looks like when you're getting traffic from different countries and locations. So when we refresh it, the IP changes and the country changes. Um, in, real, um, in real campaigns, um, these IPs will be static and it will be based on the actual IP of the person that hit the page. Alright, so um, one of the features that you have here is the ability to download this as an Excel report and then this will let you do other um, custom reports that you want to run on your data. Now let's take a quick look at SpyView and this is for real-time clicks that are coming through. So for example, um, if we wanted to have, um, if we wanted to, to sit here and watch the traffic coming into the page in real time, this is the page that you, we would use for that. And let me try sending some clicks. I'm going to put in some random clicks and attach some keywords to it and we'll start sending clicks through and we should see that showing up in spy view. You can see a brand new set of clicks just came through. Send some more clicks, watch the sub IDs increase. We just sent 100 clicks through into the system. So you, um, you can sit here and watch the clicks come through in real time on the spy view, and conversions also show up in real time as well.